there's more than enough great bands coming out of Southern California right now to be like the greatest scene in the world. Silver Lake, Echo Park, and Eagle Rock really have a cool thing going on right now. The Sunset Strip has died. It went through its heyday in the 80s. It spawned a lot of imitators. The kind of music that's being made now doesn't really spawn imitators. It's tough because, I mean, we do dedicate ourselves fully into the band, so there's times where we can't be working that much and you know, we're not making that much money. For the first time, we're, we're feeling little like bits of pressure. They're this close to seeing a fight happen on camera. We played the Echo probably 25 times in the past, <laughs> the past year. It's really, it's, really, it's, our, it's kind of our home. This is a hobby so at this point in my life. I've already sold my soul to be a lawyer. There's certain bands that we know who made it, and there's certain bands like we haven't made it yet. All we can hope for is that tonight he keeps it together. It's okay. Okay, okay I screwed up. You don't have to stop. Turn that thing off, would you? You know, it's, it's the sad reality is that not everybody in the scene will make it. Nowadays, it's almost like you have to prove that you're going to sell at least 100,000 records in order for a record company to be like, okay, well, we can give you lots of money. I don't know how you measure success. You know, does success mean you're getting played on every radio station in the country? Or does success mean you have a great deal on an indie label and you're able to live off the money you make touring and selling merchandise? Maybe once a year we get a band that makes it. Maybe once. That can quit their day jobs for real. It's like the lottery, you know, it could be any, any one of them. If this is it, if this is it, and this is what I do, I am happy.